guys. Okay, so we back. So let's go see what Yennefer wanted. Another one too, mysterious passenger or something. Was that a main quest? No. did know how to win, friends. I was provoked. Mm -hmm. So it happened. Wanted to talk to me about something? Amos Faripsis. A specialist on jinns. Heard of him? I found a tome he penned in the Emperor's library. Faripsis set off to Skellige one day and was never heard from again. I asked some of the local folk. Some here still remember him. They know what happened to him? The locals say they last saw his ship off the coast of Hindisfjall. Then a once in an eon storm broke. So he's probably fish food by now. Not necessarily. I must learn what became of him. Why? Do you know him? No. It's not the mage who interests me. It's his gin. Why are you even interested? Gins are dangerous sometimes and malicious all the time. I remember, but the advantages outweigh the risks. If I can tame a djinn, I shall gain incredible power, and that could be useful to us one of these days. All right. It seems like a exactly terrible idea. You must help me find this djinn. I've no gold to offer in reward, but I shall be ever so grateful. Since you put it that way, fine. I'll help you. Thank you. A boat awaits in the harbor. Come. Any other quests show up? I swear, I saw it's giving me quest updates for quests that I don't see. Mm. See, you've managed to prepare everything already. I have. How could you possibly know I'd agree? I didn't. Decided to risk it. Yes, Jen. Just once, you might try to take the initiative. Would you even let me? It would depend on the situation. Oh boy. Respect, Witcher. Oh, I can't talk to him. Uh, yes. The ship carrying the gin sank somewhere in this area. Not too precise as leads go. I'll cast a spell on our boat. We'll know if there are any wrecks on the seafloor below us. All right, let's get to work. Mind if I take the helm? <sighs> I got a choice. No. Do I gotta sit up here? Okay, there we go. Not sure this gin thing's a good idea. 
We managed to seize one before. Do you remember? Of course. Dandelion almost lost his voice that time. <laughs> how lucky your exorcism saved him. That was in the TV show. Yeah, how was I supposed to know that incantation meant be gone and plow yourself? You should have studied foreign languages. Gonna keep bringing that up for the rest of my life. Of course. Your last wish effectively assured it. My wish was about us being together always, not about you mocking my every mistake. Careful what you wish for. And when your wish is granted, you must accept it with all attendant circumstances. Yeah. And as for your missteps, I don't like to see why I shouldn't laugh. Very easy. There's something here. Is that a whale? It's too deep here. You can't dive that long. You underestimate me. On the contrary. After all, I asked you for help. I'll cast a spell. It will slow your heart for a time. You can stay so much longer. Asad, I cried a rithorn. Ready. Careful down there. Oh, I have a feeling I might not like this. I'm not reading your mind, but using telepathy. Besides, you've nothing to hide, right? You wouldn't admit it if I did. Not the point. See anything interesting? A shipwreck and a cavern. I'll look inside. Snapped masts, busted planks, and a whole swarm of drowners. Probably drawn by the corpses of drowned crew. Then made their nest here. There's also a Clan Drummond figurehead. Not the right ship. Come back up. But maybe there's treasure down here. Here, I'm getting my treasure. I swear to God, if there ends up being like a shark that eats me or something, I'm gonna cry. This is not supposed to be a horror game. To now. Wherever the leads take us. Say we find the gem. What do we do? Ask for a beautiful house, and a palace, and a queen's crown. Are we still talking about the gym, or have we moved on to a talking fish? Doesn't much matter. Both make wishes come true. What would yours be? You learn in deep things. Here, another wreck. Let's see if our gin's down there. Found a wreck. 
damage on it. Look around, but be careful. Look for something that might indicate it's the mage's ship. Beautiful craftsmanship. What do you have? A war horn, bearing the clan Hanai symbols. Got a chest, really old. Must have fell off the wrecked longship. Can you open it? Hoping for pirate treasure. I hope to find the gin. Try to open it. Got something. A Skelliger's buckler. Clan Hamai symbols. Don't ask, Clan. Donor was a babe in swaddling clothes when this buckler landed here. Longship belonged to Clan Dimon. Yen. Doubt any of these boats were the mages. These are old sunken longships. Come back then. We must search elsewhere. Now that's what I call war booty. Have you found the gin? No. But I found something that could be just as valuable to me as the gin is to you. I found a recipe that I had already, like. I do not want to see the end one. I prefer to observe matters from up here, most definitely. Yeah, like when we were looking for the golden dragon and an avalanche swept us off the trail. Me clinging to the remains of a bridge for dear life. You gripping my waist, admiring the view. Remember, the chasm below us was breathtaking. Rustling trees, a lazily flowing stream. I remember, though I found myself admiring what I had right in front of me. I wonder. So I was wondering if it was going to go there. <laughs> Gripping his waist, admiring what was in front of her. Something strange about those rocks. And there's something on the bottom. Let's we'll see what it is. Fuck, that scared the shit out of me. I thought that there was like See something? Something doesn't do it justice. A huge crater, as if a meteorite landed here. I must see it. Diving in after all? No, I should cast another spell to see through your eyes. Now relax. I see Fulcher Badem Ain Achter Ilivade. That is no meteorite crater. What is it then? The effect of teleportation. I see Fulcher Badem aim Achter Ilivate. No conventional weapon can do this. Silver. Ruin crested cutlery. Should belong to someone awfully wealthy. Amos was no pauper. It could very well be his ship. See something over here. No gin here, but there's something you ought to like. What? Half a seal. That'll do. Come back up. Yeah, that siren floating up beside me gave me, like, nightmares of back to, like, Subnautica. Only found half. Can you do anything with this? I can use it to locate the other half. To it was huge! It was, like, this big! Once we find that, we should find the <laughs> How big it was on the ground! Ready? I'll take us there on the count of three. Oh, no, not another portal. Stop whining. One, two. Three. Said you were gonna go.
go on three. I did. Look, we must search the area. Yen, not so fast. Gotta tell me what this is about first. Why do you want this, Jin? But you already know. A Jin's power is- You missed it trying to lure Fluffy towards me? Ooh, is she in your room? Won't warm your way out of it. Not this time. Tell me the truth or I'll leave. You needn't resort to blackmail. You would have learned eventually. True, but after the fact, I want to know now. <sighs> How long has this been going on, Geralt? This thing between us. 15, 20 years? We repeatedly split up. Progress is good! Something draws us to each other. But I can never be certain if it's a true feeling or merely a bit of mischief by a djinn. So that's it. This is about my last wish. You asked that djinn to bind us together forever. I want to ask this one to take that wish back. I get it. You want to know what'll happen if magic no longer binds us. I want to know if when the djinn's magic is gone, if we've any magic left of our own. that myself many times you see we're just a step away from learning the truth come let's search the ship is this gonna be that random ship we found on the yes it is I was wondering how that got up here seems Amos was quite the eccentric Asking the Jin to lift half his ship to a mountain top. He didn't necessarily. Jins are inherently mischievous. This one might have granted his wish and perverted it in doing so. In that case, I'd appreciate it if you didn't wish I'd disappear from your life. I've yet to decide how to grant it. Interesting. Then why is it something I can look at? Nothing here. Oh god. Interesting. Okay, so this is interesting. Mysteries, Agnes of Glanville. Hmm. Jennifer go. Nice shoes. Looks like the impact with the mountain was so powerful it popped the wearer right out of them. Wonder what this means. Nice shoes. Looks like the impact with No, the was so I was looking at the slidey. Right Blood. Someone was dragged across the deck. War left this mark when the ship suddenly tipped to one side. Did he get squished? He got squished. What do you have? It's Amos. Looks exactly like. And to see if GTA bugs out again. Except his head was intact. Think 
think the djinn did this to him? No, it wouldn't attack its master. This looks rather like an unfortunate accident. When the storm broke, Amos must have uttered a wish like, take us away anywhere to a mountaintop. And the djinn granted the wish literally. They had a hard landing. Amos was thrown off his feet and against the wall. The bookcase did the rest. Always knew too much studying could kill you. If he died while being teleported, Seal might still be on him. Behold. Bravo! Look, look at how freaking huge it is! Colds preserved the corpse. Hmm. Died from head trauma. Bookcase cracked his skull. Must have been a hard landing atop this mountain. Why are you making me walk on this thing that is... I'm bound to fall off and die at some point. What are you going to do? Summon and tame the djinn. It's not likely to be happy. Stand at the ready. Kem Jin, Rif Kaishta M. Gaya, Kaishta Ep Disclare, Divirid Me Castle. I have a bad feeling about this. I said it's a level 15 quest and I'm like level 20 something. But I don't want to fight on this ship. I'm gonna die. I will fall off and die. Meridium and Elementa oil. I did it! Got you! Your master died before uttering his last wish. I cannot capture you. We can struggle like this for eternity or I can release you. If you do one thing for me. Do you see the spell that binds us? 
Only a djinn can remove another djinn's spell. Remove this one and you'll be free. Is that a yes? You are free. I'm gonna say yes. Storm's over. Yes. It's all over. Maybe we should sit. One slot away from a free car? Ooh. I'm not, but we can sit. Oh wait, no, that's not a good thing. Too bad I wasn't there to make your spin for you, then you would have gotten the free car. Or you would have gotten like the lowest prize available. Feel any better? I told you, I'm fine. Don't need to play tough for me. That was a hard fight. Maybe not as hard as the last time we tamed a djinn, but still. <laughs> no comparison, I'm afraid. Half of Ryan suffered then. Now I'm merely a bit tired. Thank you for coming, Geralt. I'd have had a much harder time of it on my own. Well, never could say no to you. Hmm. Perhaps that will change now. Feel anything? That anything's different? Hmm. I expected... I don't know what I expected, actually. A bit of vertigo, perhaps. I thought... you'd become a stranger to me. That I'd look at you and not feel a thing. But it's not like that at all. Nothing's changed. Jen might have cheated us after all. Why? Because I don't feel that anything's changed either. I love you, Yen. And I love you. Ah. Kiss him with the wolf mask. Do it. Do it. Oh God! It went through her face. Sweetness and light. Strange. <laughs> but it felt like our first kiss to me. It was. You expected it, and so I, I know. I've I'm actually so been. I love you. The kiss has to taste differently. I've been wanting that to like. I've been wanting to see what would happen this whole time since I've been wearing the mask. Maybe we ought to test a few other things. Amos's cabin looked cozy. Not so fast, Geralt. We'll have plenty of time to visit cozy cabins later. But I doubt the world will end if we sit here a while. No worries, Max. <sighs> My, it's lovely. Mm -hmm. I think the spirits of Skellige favor us. Those are actually some nice shots. I grabbed some screenshots. Next time we go on horseback. A horse would never make it down that mountain. What now? Well, I'm due to appear in Vizima. ruin it by hashing out the details. I'm going to see the Baron. Collect Uma from him, then we'll ride for Kaer Morin. I shall join you as quickly as I can. See you again. Take care of yourself. Okay. So we don't want to do that yet. We're going to do every Skellige quest that we can find.
Right. Oh wait, we gotta meditate. Cause I said a potions and bombs. And we gotta put my favorite bombs back. Check my alchemy as well. What all am I missing? Okay, so I'm just missing a ton of the black one and those white flowers. So if we grab those whenever we see them... Like, we'll check this guy up here for more of those flowers. Would you like to buy something for me, Stash? Maybe. Let me see what you got. So we want to grab those. So long. No, because I was missing the black one too. I was like, Rurik, right? Heard you were on a boat the drowners attacked. I I was with Ulf. My cousin, gathering our crab traps off the Kjerrig cliffs. Ulf was pulling up a line, having a hard time of it. You know, grand, I thought. Cage has got to be full, it'll be a good haul. Then something tugged back and down. Weren't a blink and Ulf was underwater. Called after him, once, twice, thrice. Then the water went red with blood. I smelled something horrid. Rotten, but worse. In the moor, Diablin flipped the boat. Don't even know how I made it ashore. Must have had Freer watching over me. That, or the monsters had eaten their fill. Thanks for the story. There's another guy up here. Lovely scar. Are you Tove? I was told drowners killed your husband. Then you were told right. First the sea took my son, and now my man. I'm the only one left. Chavilla, our son. He went out fishing and didn't come back. My man would walk out to the Kira Cliffs every day to watch for his boat. I told him he cannot bring him back to life, and that he could die himself. We'd heard about drowners, but he couldn't sit still. Donned his old coat and went. One night, he didn't come home. I fetched me brother, grabbed a torch, and we went looking for him. The Muera Diablin. Sea fiends. They clawed him so bad, I only knew him by his coat. Small comfort, I know. But the drowner problem will soon end. I promise you that. <sighs> Farewell. Is there um Firesdale Caratrol? I think this is the one that. Like this one should be right here, right? Really? It's actually really far away. Uh, there's one more. Okay, so there's are, those are a lot farther than I thought they'd be. So we'll continue with this one.
Let's go, Roach. Necrophage oil. Is that a cave there? Yup. How are there footprints underwater? I don't think it would work that way. Also, I don't know how I just drank water underwater, but we'll go with it. Lair, but definitely Bruises not on our neck. Crushed larynx, strangled. Oh no! Almost untouched, hidden for later. Drowners just don't do that. on his neck, 
crushed larynx, strangled. smell. She won't come back while I'm here, unless she coexists with drowners. Maybe I could make an extract from their plans, cover up my scent. I actually, I have that potion. Um... should do it. Now for a place to hide and wait. Behind those boats. No, let me loot everything! Make sure that this is refreshed. We go. Yay, I'm dead. Was this way though? Another way out. Another way out.
Uh, poison on my sword. Cutting people in half is fun. So quest should be just down here. Job's done. Here's the Yay! Now why would I want to see What the devil is that? Water hag. An old clever one. She was the danger. Seen a lot of ugly critters in my life. Moris, lampreys, blobfish. But never nothing like this. Your award. Well earned, Witcher. Well earned. Yay! All dead. Think I deserve more. Water hags significantly more dangerous than drowners. Not denying it, but my coin pouch ain't exactly bottomless. Neither is the sea. Plenty more filth ready to crawl up from its bottom. Might need my services again. And I won't stick my neck out for those who skimp on the reward. Starting protection coin, eh? Take it. Take all I got. And choking it, you bugger. I was kind of a dick. No such thing as bad ships or bad weather. Only worthless fucking shape. How much money did I get? Oh, I missed it. That's okay. But I'm at 7k. Okay. So Okay, so there's this one here. And then I think so once we do this one, everything else is level 20 something, so I think we'll just start from the tre treasure hunts and just go up the list and do everything that's in Skellige. Let's talk to this merchant and see what we can sell. Show me what you got and we'll see. Okay, quick sort. What was this? Oh, jeez, look at that. I like that, okay. Uh...
so long. See you not from round here. What's brought ye to speak, Arog? Heard you've got a job for a witcher. Aye. My sister's near drilled a hole in me, got pestering me. I hung a notice, hoping she'd let up. Truth be told, didn't really expect anyone to take an interest. What's this about? My sister's betrothed. He's disappeared. Folks say he done a runner. Sis claims she saw a beast carry him off. Sensing you just don't believe your sister. They had their ups, they had their downs. Lil's thoroughbred skirt chaser. And Brit's just not easy to be around. But wow. Secret, He's pretty much calling his sister a bitch. Finding Nils won't be easy. Reward you posted's not enough. Bring him home, and I'll spare no coin. Need to hear something specific. A sum. First, you gotta tell me something specific. What happened to Nils? Well, now, dunno. Would you consider dropping it a bit? Agreed. There we go. I'll see what I can do. Want to talk to your sister first off. Britt and Nils had their favorite spot. Cliffs north of the village. Ever since he went missing, she's been wandering about there. Seems like everyone has yellowish eyes in this place. I kind of noticed that too. Like, aside from Yennefer, almost everybody has like yellowish or greenish eyes. Like, you don't really see brown eyes. Or blue, again, aside from Yennefer. I noticed that though, I was gonna mention it before. I don't know if I did, I might have at some point. Need to talk to you. <laughs> Leave me be. Did you see Nils die? I, I, I saw a shadow, great wings, like a cloud passing over the sky. Then I heard him scream. Something grabbed him, lifted him up, then flew off towards the caves on the shore. But he was alive, screaming my name. <laughs> I'll look into it. Got to explore those caves Brit mentioned. Okay, guys, I'm gonna take a quick. I'm gonna. Okay, this break isn't gonna be quite so quick. I'm gonna get uh, some stuff ready and going, kind of for dinner. Uh, so this break will be a little bit longer potentially. Man, bat harpy. I was thinking like maybe like um, or a siren even even. But yeah, I'm gonna be back in a bit. I'm just gonna get some food going, and then we will continue with some more Witcher.